Hi guys, so I'm just covering my face because what would you choose? This one or this one? What would you choose? So this is the makeup tutorial. You have two looks in one palette, two looks for a summertime night summer slash night time uh, makeup look. And these are the two suggestions I'm bringing for you. This one and this one. Hola chicos y chicas, uh, bueno, um, bienvenidos a EG Makeup Artist. Y esto es una colaboración con, me, con Diva Latina Eva, ¿no? Hola mis queridas divas, mi nombre es Martina, propietaria del canal Marty Beauty y después de ver el vídeo de mi amiga AG Makeup, os invito a que os paséis por mi canal para que veáis la propuesta de maquillaje que tengo preparado para vosotras. Así que nos vemos por allí. ¡Mua! Chao. La colaboración se trata de una sugerencia para un look de verano, para noche, y yo os traigo dos opciones, ¿vale? Siempre podéis cambiar el tono, el color de los labios según os convenga, según o, os guste para match, para combinarlo con, con el color de ojos, ¿no? Ahora os voy a enseñar el otro eh, look y este es el otro look. So uh, the first thing I want to say is that this uh, Dixon's uh, toner is really working on me. It looks like it unifies my tone, my skin tone. Eh, este Dixon eh, toner is muy bueno, me está unificando la piel y me encanta. This is a collaboration, as I said before. This is a collaboration with my colleague, uh, Diva Latina Ebony. And yeah, I'm gonna give you two ideas for makeup. Two ideas in makeup to rock in summer, nighttime. So yeah, stay tuned. Hola chicas, esto es una colaboración que tengo con Diva Latina Ebano o Ebony, si, mal, eh, si no lo tengo mal, y lo que el, la colaboración se trata de sugerir eh, pues un look uh, veraniego y de noche, ¿no? Yo voy a recrear dos looks uh, veraniegos, uno mate, uno con eyeshadows con sombras mate y otro con sombras eh, shimmer, de brillosas, de purpurina, o de glitter, no, no glitter, perdón, de pur con purpurina. I'm featuring the collaboration with uh, the Zulu palette, and this is uh, by Juviance, the Juviance. And I'm gonna grab this orange color, which I'm gonna be applying for both looks as a transition color. So I'm gonna be applying this uh, as a transition color, as I said before, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna be blending this in my outer V and going and moving forward into my inner eye or inner corner. And guys, uh, soon you guys are gonna have um, a tutorial in which I explain in detail really how I apply my eyeshadows. So I grabbed this uh, brown color, you know, I was so surprised to notice this color in my eye. I think it's probably because um, the base I've used for my eyes, like the, eyes the eyeshadow and primer, is uh, a bit light. That's why this color shows up. But anyways, it was gorgeous. I was so impressed and I loved it so much. Well, now I'm grabbing this is a Define and Conceal by Makeup Revolution and this is in C12. 
I'm applying that as a base. And I'm grabbing the yellow uh, color and I'm going to pop this uh, in the middle of my lid. And uh, yeah, just going to leave a little bit of space in my teardrop just to add a brighter color, you know. So from the same palette, I'm going to uh, grab this uh, foxier color. And I'm going to tap this a uh, little bit in my teardrop just to brighten up my look. Remember, this is a summer suggestion, so color are allowed, okay? Color has to be popping, and this is what I'm going to be doing: popping colors in my eyes and you know, brighten my face. Also, blending as well. You guys know the way I go about the eyeshadow application. So I'm grabbing a little bit more of this brown color. I mean, this color is amazing. Like, wow. When I see this color applied in pale com uh, complexions, it's like, wow. But you know, I didn't know it could be on my skin as well. So yeah, I'm gonna grab this. Uh, this is a, a emerald. I can say emerald. Uh, not emerald. But this is like a green grass, green grass, grass green. <laughs> Anyways, and I'm gonna apply this um, rose gold, and uh, as well, this is a technique I do to make my eyeshadows, especially the shimmer eyeshadows, to pop more, to give that brightness and you know to have that uh, vivid color. And I'm going as well with that brown color. And retouching, retouching as I always do. So talking about about summer, vivid color, brighten. So I thought of applying this blue as a eyeliner just to have that festive-ish popping color on me. And I really loved the uh, final result because this is a really cute is so cute uh, look and uh, on the other eye I did apply a purple shimmery uh, eyeliner because you know the entire eye is already shimmered so that was the goal anyway I don't know about you guys but for me I don't even know which one to choose and I was so daring that I stepped out of my house with these two colors in my eye. <laughs> oh lord, that's how crazy I am anyway. I'm so in love with this brown color. Uh, so I'm applying my primer and uh, yeah, what I'm doing now is applying this Fenty Beauty is a sample I had a long time ago when they came out with the 40 shades and this is a, a 30 shade 30 which acts as a color corrector on me but I didn't know that it could be I mean it's a foundation but because it's too rich really orangey but anyways uh, it was so nice and I decided to use it as an overall foundation or base or call it what you want and yeah I love love the results by the way, there's something wrong with my lighting. If you are good with lighting and you know what's going on with my camera, please let me know in the comment section below, okay? Because every time I apply this scarf on my head, this is a nice color, it comes out. But then if I remove it, you guys have that um, sad grayish color coming through. Anyways. So I'm applying the trio and oh by the way this sponge is so huge and I committed the error I did not wet or dump this brush and it was so hard to blend everything that I needed to go after all with a brush but anyways uh, I like it and this uh, sponge is to apply shimmer on your skin like highlights you know and all those stuff body lava situation so yeah i'm really in love of um the rihanna fancy or fancy beauty uh, line makeup line it's really nice you know and it makes you look so natural like so on point anyway so on point i'm in love with it 
and for sure whenever they finish on my uh, collection I will definitely go for um, the trio, the foundation and the primer of course. Okay, so what I have in this foil, I took it from my cousin, and it is the Laura Mercier uh, translucent powder. Although it looks like a main powder for cook, girl, I committed a mistake because this looked exactly like fleur on my skin. It was so white, and wow, I was just thinking in my head like. How the hell I'm gonna get rid of all this ashiness on me? And what I end up doing, what I'm applying now is my finishing powder by MAC. By the way, it's almost finished. I need to buy a new one because that's my go to go. And I packed and packed and packed this uh, finishing powder on me. And it's the NW45 uh, or 46, if I'm not wrong. So I got this on my face till I achieve this look. So I'm using this coral color as a blush. You know, I want to have everything smooth. And from uh, the Chroma palette, this is by um, the Kardashian, the, the Kardashian, 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 Kardashian. Anyways, uh, I really like this highlight because it's so smooth, it's so natural, and it's not that uh, too obvious, you know. And I'm applying these on the bridge of my nose, the tip of my nose, my cupid bow, and a bit on my lip. And this is a burgundy lip liner from Makeup Revolution. I really like Makeup Revolution's uh, lip liners. Uh, I think I'm gonna be having more from them. But anyway, I'm just uh, blending my lip liner because you don't wanna have those harsh lines. So you wanna uh, blend everything and let it be smooth. This is a color co uh, color because as well is a summer look so we are allowed to go crazy with colors and yeah why not it matches with both look i mean so finishing with my setting spray and this is what you got guys uh let me know which one would you choose seriously which one do you like the most Whichever floats your boat, whichever, uh, whichever, uh, whichever vibe go with you, that would be cool. Just let me know in the comment section below which one would you like, which one you prefer, which one goes more with you, with your uh, summertime slash look vibe, you know, ish. Let me know in the comment section down below. Also, give me a thumbs up if you like it. And subscribe to the channel if you are not, of course. You are more than welcome. Si os ha gustado el video, regalame una mano arriba. Si estás suscrito al canal, pues bueno, bienvenidos y muchas gracias. Si no, pues ya sabes, si te gusta el contenido, suscríbete abajo o aquí, no aquí, allá. Aquí, suscríbete aquí, aquí abajo, aquí. Aquí está el este de suscripción, suscríbete. Y ya verás más uh, recreaciones mías, más um, tutoriales y mucho más contenido, ¿no? Como de pelo y otras cosas más. En fin, pues eso. Muchísimas gracias por estar ahí. Muchísimas gracias por ver el video. Y no te olvides de ir a chequear la colaboración porque la tengo con Diva Latina, Ébano. Y os voy a dejar el canal de ella aquí abajo, link o aquí. Arriba o abajo. Una de dos. Así que no os olvidéis de ir a chequear y ver qué es lo que ella os propone para este verano. Una noche cualquiera. Calidad con los amigos. Pues eso, a pasarla bien. 
Tchau.